Welcome back to Host. Last episode, we took our flamethrower up against a DJI drone. Link in the description, check that one out. It was pretty cool. I yep. think we're probably one of the first ones to do it as yep. well. Yep. And it probably still flies, but go see the outcome. Link in the description. We'll kill it one day. Anyways, today guys, we got a really cool video for you. We picked up dry ice. We are going to hit that with the flamethrower, see what happens, because when you hit it with water, it creates a fog machine. So what's gonna happen when we hit fire? But before the fire, we gotta see what happens when we take our pressure washer up against dry ice. Hopefully you have a smoke machine, so let's get it. All right guys, so we've actually never had dry ice before, so this is a first for us as well. Dry ice, I think, what was the surface temp? 109.3 degrees Fahrenheit. We're gonna measure ourselves though. You definitely don't wanna touch it because I read that it's cold enough, the effects are like, God damn, it's cold through the glove. <laughs> the effects are cold enough that it, it kills the skin cells, so effectively, the injury is the same as a burn which we don't want. So, it's cold. So here it is, dry ice. Caution. 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 Don't do this at home, children. Unless you have gloves, then it's okay. Oh, that's fucking cold, dude. <laughs> oh, that's really cold. I need better gloves. Let me grab the thermometer real quick. Yeah. All right, let's, let's take a cold reading on it. Let's check his temperature, see if she's got a fever. So far we're at, it's reading about negative 14 degrees right now. Negative 14 degrees? Yep. That's pretty freaking cold. Yeah, touch your tongue to it, please. No. <laughs> is, it is this cold. toxic? No, it's not toxic. Taste it. You idiot. You're an idiot. <laughs> He's never going to be able to taste anything again. <laughs> How's it feel? It feels like snow. Honestly, like when you're wearing No, clothes. on your tongue. <laughs> it just felt like... It felt like snow on my tongue. It just felt like ice, honestly. Hold it there for a few seconds. So this piece is reading like negative 30 degrees. Negative 28. All right, guys. So right now, before we hit it with the pressure washer, we're going to show you kind of what water does to dry ice. We're going to drop this in the water bottle here. And supposedly, if you cap off the water bottle, the water reacts with the carbon dioxide that's in the dry ice, and we'll make this go boom. So, let's hit it. Oh, put it all in there. Yeah, it's gonna go. <laughs> that's good. Cap it. Nope. Oh, it's done. <laughs> it's really? Done. Really? It's gonna go boom. Look at it. Woo! <laughs> God! <laughs> I think I just lost my hearing. Holy, f that was no, badass. So, so we were just gonna do one test with a water bottle, but that was freaking badass. So we're gonna do it again, this time with a two liter bottle of Coke. Empty the Coke out. Of course we drank it, we're not gonna waste it. But we're gonna fill up that two liter with water, drop more dry ice in there, and we're gonna back way the fuck up because that one was terrifying. But we're gonna do it again. So we're gonna give Zach the face mask so he doesn't blow his face off. Oh boy, he's about to drop the first one in. You're not supposed to touch it, Zach. Oh <laughs> Game's over here hiding oh behind gosh, the fence. I saw it the first time. <laughs> oh, dude, it is going. He's just touching it with his hands like it's no big deal. Oh, this is going to be loud. Oh, God, he's capping it. He's capping it. Bat run, Zach. Oh, my God. Oh, it's swelling. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh God! Oh I'll step it back. The anticipation. Oh my God! This is. <laughs> oh. Dude, <laughs> blew the GoPro off of its stand, dude. <laughs> That in my oh, whole it's body. It's hot. Feel it. The it's, water's it's hot. The water's hot. Yeah. Yeah. That was crazy. Oh yeah. That's enough. Yeah. We're done. That, that's enough. Wow. This Split. is what is left of the Coke bottle. It is just destroyed. Just destroyed. Cap stayed on. <laughs> <laughs> what we're gonna do is probably a terrible idea, but what do we do? That's not a terrible idea. So right now, let me show you guys. We have this bucket full of water. 
We are about to drop an entire six pound bag of dry ice. This cap seals it off completely. And we're gonna have our stunt man here <laughs> set everything up while we hide behind that tree over there. I'm hiding behind the barn. Yeah. <laughs> so he's got a helmet, he'll be fine. Yeah. <laughs> and he's got a GoPro on his head just in case he explodes. So <laughs> if I die, we're gonna get good footage of it. So that's all I want. Yeah. You gonna drop it? I'm gonna put the lid on. You start pressing it down. Okay. Three, two, two, one, go. Oh my God. Seal that shit. Oh God. Seal it, Justin. I'm Seal it. No, it's it's not sealed. It's not sealed. I know it's not sealed. Oh. My. It's not sealing, bro. Oh shit. That goes. You better army crawl back, Justin. <laughs> Oh, it's fizzing, right? <laughs> this might take a minute. Bro, it's built up pretty good. Really? I couldn't even press down the lid. <laughs> God. This is behind the scenes. We are all hiding behind this tree. Stunt man over here. <laughs> Just go poke it with the wood. Oh, good God. <laughs> He's still gonna miss to the left. <laughs> Stupid. Boom! <laughs> he can't he can hit it. Uh oh. Go in there, safety man. Just whack the sh out of the bucket. Now it's pissed. <laughs> Just give it a good old whammo on its head. <laughs> He's sealing it with the wood. Oh, Keep hitting it. Hit. Oh. <laughs> hit to the side. Hit to the side. Hit from the side. Smack that. Oh, he broke the quad. Hey, smack that seal on. Oh. It's the moment you've all been waiting for. What is this flamethrower going to do to that dry ice? <laughs> What? It's like unfazed. Yeah, I know. It's not doing anything. We're gonna crank it all the way up. What do you think? Yeah, dude, dude Let's go do for it. it. So it's really not doing anything. You can kind of see it taking little little layers off of it, but it's not doing any fog. It's not melting it. Really so, surprising. Yeah, it's it's unscathed and it, it's it's a little weird. I thought it was gonna melt, but since this is carbon dioxide ice and not water ice, I don't know. So, I, <laughs> so right now we're gonna check the temperature of it with the temp gun here. If it's still cool, we're gonna feel it, see if it's still cold to the touch, and try to finish it off. So let's see what happens. So right now, it is still negative 14 degrees on the ice. So of course, Zach has unfazed. to touch it. So just for reference, let's see how hot the flame is. The barrel of the flamethrower is at 500-ish degrees and it's hard to get a read on the flame itself. All right guys, that is it for this episode. So we couldn't kill the dry ice with the flamethrower. It wouldn't melt, didn't change temperature. It took out chunks of the concrete though. Yeah. But but that's about it. I, I thought we were gonna have some sort of crazy fog show or something, but no, no man, it was, it was still pretty cool. I think the concrete was cooler than the actual dry ice, but hey, maybe video ideas. But anyways guys, like, 
Comment what you want to see next. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit that dumb bell so you see everything else we do. But until next time, guys, this is Host. Peace. Peace. This is Host.